Hello everyone, welcome back to Mayuri Stock Channel. By looking the thumbnail, you would have understood like why I am making this video for you. So before starting, just I request you to subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon so that you will get notification whenever I will be doing a new video. So uh, I am doing this video for the sixth semester student. I know your test one have just completed. You will be having a test two and the end semester which will be in May. Just I downloaded your syllabus then the sample papers of last year which were in offline mode right it were offline mode and now also you will have in offline mode. So just I went through and like I would like to tell through this video like on which chapters you are supposed to focus more on like which questions like how the kind of questions will be appearing in your end semester regarding this i am making this video for you okay so before going to your syllabus just one thing i would like to tell you all is that your t1 t2 marks are also very important if you wanted to score more than 95 percentage in this semester okay along with the internal marks which your college gives you also matters a lot one and one marks is very important even at one point you just uh, thought that no here my marks can increase just go and talk and increase that marks because one and one marks are really very important because competition is very tough and as you know after diploma you will be having a direct second year admission for your degree and there are very few sets okay so now we will be turning towards your syllabus and after that i will tell you like uh, what kind of notes I will be providing you on which chapter on which your subject I will be providing the notes how will uh, I help you to have a good marks in your end semester okay so this I will be covering at the end of this video now let's just have a look on your syllabus where I will tell you overview of your syllabus on which you are supposed to focus more which you are supposed to give more time and less time based on the chapters what kind of questions will come and all the things so let's have a view on your syllabus copy so guys welcome to your academic calendar so this is something your academic calendar just i downloaded your practical exam will be in april uh, 27th it will start and theory exam it will start from may 11 so before that i will try to provide as much as resources which will be helpful for your examination for sure now moving towards the syllabus this is something the syllabus is your uh, of your sixth semester you might have went through it but whenever I used to study during my semester, during my study, I used to keep this with me for during my study a particular course, a particular this, I can say courses. Okay, now the first one is the management, then Python, then MAD you have, emerging trends and elective I was having my PHP. And then 6th and 7th is entrepreneurship development. And the last one is your project, final year project. Now, practical will be of two of Python and math and uh, for your one elective. Uh, other than that, you will have 100, 100 marks for each subject. Management and emerging trends will be your online. Right. This will be your online. So, for management, talking about management, how you will study for management. Now, while doing study, I used to go through this topics and subtopics. Now, for this, a particular manual is provided for you guys, right? For emerging trade and management too. So, for this, that particular these topics and subtopics are covered. Totally all these are covered and single MCQ will not come out of that manual. So you are supposed to refer that manual, complete manual and go through each and every line and understand it, what exactly the particular concepts are there. Now, wettage, if you see total marks, wettage and particular chapter, every chapter have high wettage. So you are supposed to do this, all the chapters in depth for your management. Okay, now moving towards the Python which is very easy language and a scoring subject where you can score out of out marks too. This is something about the Python. 
and talking about python my dear friends tomorrow if you go for your degree or for your job if you are working with machine learning if you are working with data science python you should know i mostly we use python there. so python like if you are doing it just do and clear the concept have hands on on each and every syntax each and every program so you get very familiar with python and it's very easy language if you look at this introduction of syntax of uh, the first chapter includes the syntax of python program the second is about the operators and control flow statements like if you have familiar with c c++ the same thing will be there here but the syntax will be different in python so here if you see the topics and sub topics so here it looks like it uh, have lot of sub topics but this are very very easy i will try to provide you notes so that only through that notes before exam you can just revise it look over it and it will be best on your syllabus only okay now sure if you see the next chapter function modules and packages about in python how we exactly do is there in this whole chapter and the object oriented uh, concepts in python then the next will be based on the file input output handling and exception handling now here if you see the marking system like how much time you are supposed to give for a particular topic or unit if you see the first to have eight then 10 marks that means two marks question for sure will come from unit first unit two okay and last for if you see it have high weightage that means you are supposed to uh, give much time for this last four now if you look this first two eight and 10 marks that is 18 marks are in your hand here you have a 99.9% probability that you will get out of out marks for sure okay so this is something how you are supposed to study while if you are taking any kind of uh, course like it might be mad it can might be python it might be any other like php you are supposed to follow the same strategy the next one is mobile application development so if you are very familiar with java it's nothing much difficult to work with android and if you are familiar with the android studio it's very actually interesting to work with android studio my dear friends like if you see her the first like uh, moving towards the syllabus the first two chapters are totally theoretical so this are like depends on you how you study this to first two chapter now third and fourth if you see the sub topics are very less it's are basically different layouts different components which will help you to build your application like in android you have predefined function using that you can build it very easily yeah now the last two chapter like it have lot of content but if you go one by one like uh, uh, now sure if you see the multimedia framework play audio video text to speech sensor how exactly the code we do it like what exactly function we use it so it will be very easy to write in a paper and also you will understood like how exactly it works okay now moving towards the marking system if you see the first three chapter have very less weightage and they are somewhat easy like first two i already told it's a theoretical so these marks are in your hand this 10 marks and then again 8 marks also is your in your hand so here you can score out of out marks for sure last two chapters have high weightage so i will try to provide um, like notes on this and how questions will be there from particular chapter that also i will try to give you okay now the next one is emerging trends in computer and information technology the same thing which i told you about the management the manual particular is provided just go through it line by line and from that only all the things will come if you to see the total marks here 6 18 18 12 16 yeah it has six total six units it has so you are supposed to go through each and every 
think that like fourth and third it have less weightage so you can spend not much time on this two but other are very important so this is something how you are supposed to study while doing study you are supposed to keep the syllabus with you so this is something about your syllabus and how you are supposed to focus on a particular thing so and here like i would like to tell you practical things are also very important try to score their good marks and this marks are in the hands of your college just try to submit your assignments on time because one and one marks really matters uh, like during our last year to score good marks if we want college like good college for our degree so this is something about your syllabus so friends this was overview of your syllabus like based on the mark system uh, based on the chapter you are supposed to focus that particular time you should understand that for two marks from this chapter the questions will come how will be the questions from other chapter based on the vector this was exact strategy strategy which i used for uh, my exam during my semester and during a six semester i really studied very hard uh, talking about the android that is uh, most of you people are getting is difficult yeah it's at first it get lots of confusion while working with android but during my time i can tell you yeah at first i was also having a somewhat fear like how i'm going to do it and all because i was having also a old laptop because for doing android application you need a very good specification uh, of your laptop so uh, i was doing practice of android on my one staff like when sir was there on his laptop i used to do practice and during college time i used to use the pcs and other than like whenever she don't wanted i used to use his laptop during other times for practicing the android and using android is really very interesting if you understand like how exactly i supposed to use it i really uh, it was really helpful for me also i like i did one application of my college like about the bg admission which was static but i just whatever the features are there in your syllabus i tried to have that in one application and which really i also now include it in my resume okay so android is not much difficult if you hands on on that android android subject okay so based on android i can tell you like i will try to provide the notes like what kind of question will be there on that particular along with the questions like what questions you may get in your examination okay so this will also try to give you Uh, which will be there with you and about the python also i, I will try to provide you notes as per your sub topics just so just before your exam you can view it and have a revision for sure and i will try my best to help you out to score good marks so during as i told i really did hard work but during the examination just before the covid started and after one year i guess our exam got scheduled which was in online mode but uh, about the management and emerging trends compulsory just follow the manual that is being provided because a single like single question will not come out of that particular manual okay then about the python it's really a scoring subject PHP is also very scoring subject where you can score really a good marks. Okay, so this is and about the Android, I will try to give my best and try to give you the notes which will be helpful for you along with the questions and other the capstone project and entrepreneurship. It totally depends on you. So guys, all the best. Only three months I guess are remaining. It's March, April, and May. Okay, three months. Three months are also not there. One and half month is there in your hand, and these months are really, really very important. So just do your best. Do your day and night, and study very hard to score good marks. Try to score good marks in your end semester as well, and in your T two and in your internal. 
वॉट एवर वर्क इज दर सो फॉर नाउ आई विल स्टॉप यूर आई विल अपडेट यू अबाउट माई नेक्स्ट वीडियो अबाउट द नोट्स आई विल रियली ट्राई टू गिव यू ऑल द थिंग्स बिफोर योर एंड सेमिस्टर स्टार्ट फॉर शॉ सो फॉर नाउ ऑल द बेस्ट डू योर बेस्ट एंड थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो थैंक यू